Hello dear students, in this video we are going to solve this question. Excess magnesium powder was added to a beaker containing hydrochloric acid. The mass of the beaker and its contents was recorded and plotted against time. Line 1, this line 1 shows the uh, graph for this one. So which change could give line 2? Firstly, here the magnesium powder reacts with HCl aqueous the reaction goes like this MgCl2 and hydrogen gas so here in the products hydrogen gas is evolved so this is in the excess amount like here it is already written so when any reactant is in the excess amount, then change in that uh, in the amount of that reactant will not change the uh, rate of reaction in any way. So here, the first option is doubling the mass of powdered magnesium. As I have already uh, told you that the change in the amount of this magnesium will not change the rate of reaction. So this two shows the change in the rate of reaction because here the mass on the y-axis and time on the x-axis so this graph goes like this which means more mass is reduced at at the same time so here firstly this mass reduces with the time which means this shows the forward reaction in which the hydrogen gas is evolved due to which the mass reduces of the reaction system mass reduces because the mass in the form of uh, hydrogen gas is evolved due to which the mass reduces so uh, there is no change in the rate of the reaction so here 2 shows the change in the rate of reaction so this is the wrong option next is using the same mass of magnesium ribbon if we use the same magnesium uh, a ma same mass of magnesium in the ribbon form then this will not change the rate of reaction so here 2 shows the change in the uh, rate of reaction as I have already uh, told you so this is also the wrong option next is increasing the temperature when we increase the temperature of this system what happens the collisions between the reactants increases due to which the rate of reaction increases so here this also shows that more mass is reduced at the same time within the same uh, time but this uh, this graph ends up here and this two graph ends up here so there is change in the mass but when we increase the temperature the amount of the hydrogen gas evolved remains same due to which the reduction in the mass remains same so the mass change in the mass here shows that the amount of the hydrogen gas is more evolved here so this is also the wrong option next is using the same volume of more concentrated hcl if we use the hcl in the same volume but of the more concentrated one so what happens the mass remains same but here due to the in more uh, due to the more concentrated HCl, the HCl molecules in the same volume increases due to which the more uh, product will be formed, which means the more uh, hydrogen gas is evolved, which means volume of the hydrogen gas evolved increases. So, due to which the more mass reduces the mass of the system reduces more because uh, more volume of hydrogen gas is evolved here so now here also you can see that here this is the final mass and here in the second one this is the mass which is less than the uh, less than in case of one so uh, d option should be the right answer so here you can see in the mark scheme also D is the right answer. So this is the whole concept behind this question. And if you like my video then please like and subscribe my video or my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for watching.